All right, well, a lot of the yards are still short, so we got home a little early. Uh, I think it's 3, 3.30, so eh, eight hour day. I figured I would, uh, it's nice out, wash the trucks while I'm here. Might as well wash the mower, so the truck and the uh, trailer came out good. Missed a couple little spots, but. So it's been about a month and a half since I've had the trailer. Um, so far, I like it. Uh, it's got its pros and cons, you know. One of the good things is you can have everything with you. Um, you know, some extra oils. You got the hedge trimmers up here, chainsaw, a uh, little cobalt toolbox. Picked up at Lowe's. Pretty much has everything you need and I actually have two of them, one in the other truck. Uh, I got it set up how I like it for the most part. Um, you know, some of the negatives are, you get some people, I haven't had to deal with it yet, but I could imagine that once you hire someone that might only be used to driving an open trailer, uh, yeah, this is a lot different. You can't see behind you really when you're backing up. You got to know where your corners are at all times. Uh, especially this one. All together, just the trailer itself. From the tip of the tongue to the door is 28 feet. So, you know, it's pretty long. Eight and a half feet wide. Um, I was going to do the kick plate along the bottom. So far. I really haven't had a reason for it. Nothing's hit. Um, so I'll probably just let that go. I did it up in the front just in case stuff does slide forward if we're on the brakes real hard at some point. Um, but other than that, it's good. It gets hot <laughs> and it's a pain in the ass to wash because it's so big. But I do like the black. The black gets dirty pretty quick. But the white, I've seen a lot of trailers where the screws up top, they start rusting or you start getting some bunch of drip marks coming down. And I'd rather, I mean, you can see here, it looks like a mirror. You can see my house right against it like it is the house. So works pretty good. Huh. Let's get to uh, washing these mowers up, put them away, and then we're done for the day. All right, well, mowers are all cleaned up. Good enough for now. I need to power wash them, really, but I didn't feel like dragging that out, so it'll do the job. The trailer's all swept out, washed, until well, tomorrow. It'll probably thunderstorm and rain tomorrow because everything's clean, but that's just how my luck is.